there's some who are looking on Prime Minister and saying, wow, you, you seem to be on a, you're kind of turbocharging some of these things to, you know, to get them done by the end of this year. Uh, they, they're thinking perhaps there's a political undertone to it. How would you respond to that? Well, we're responding to the global crisis and uh, we recognize that um, you know, it has protracted and the issue of urgent intervention uh, that becomes um, you know, even more important at this point. Uh, so it's primarily about bringing relief to the people of Antigua and Barbuda. Uh, if a chance, the opportunity arises to call elections then, well, I will give serious consideration to it. Let's talk about the elections, Prime Minister. <laughs> Constitution to do my March 2023. Since you raised it, uh, good segue. Any hint that you want to give us? Well, what I'll say is that um, the elections are due by March 23rd of next year, and we do have an extra 90 days to call elections. <laughs> Certainly, you wouldn't want to be extending so far as beyond the... You never, can, you never can tell. We have plenty of money to spend. We may need time to spend the money. <laughs> That's interesting. I'm pretty sure that uh, the, the public is ruminating on your comments there, Prime Minister. So, uh, and by the way, let me make it abundantly clear that um, in the event uh, I was to take that decision, uh, this does not represent any form of fear. Okay? In no fact, fear. I can tell you that I'm um, up to the, this point that um, the... Labour Party's governance of the country is not threatened. And we this would have had um, polls that issue. would have uh, at least indicate that um, so far the government is, is still solid. And where we may have one or two seats that uh, have some weaknesses, I believe that within the last several months that we would have um, certainly strengthened those seats. And we're now positioning the anti and Labour Party to take all 17 issue. seats. That all is 17. all 17. And I say so with a straight face. And I believe it's doable. Uh, you see, when you have a weak opposition party with um, individuals who bring no real value and individuals who are destructive in their outlook, destructive in their behavior, we have to go all out to save the country from those type of reckless um, people. 